All right, guys. Welcome to Enter the Gungeon. Um, we're going to do a blessed run today. So we've got all these coins that are nothing to spend it on. So this is the only thing we can use them up on. So we might as well go for it. Uh, hopefully, we'll do we'll do quite well with this as well. So we'll kind of see how it goes. Um, <clears throat> I've got a new microphone uh, plugged in um, for YouTube, whereas I'm actually using a different camera microphone for the purely based on the fact that my capture card can record. Uh, from one audio um, and the camera will record for Twitch. If that makes any sense to you guys anyway, it makes sense to me, but um, basically what it does is uh, it allows me to uh, edit the audio in post without having to uh, ruin the game audio as well. Um, so that's kind of that. Um, whoa. So is there a time for when these weapons change or they just change kind of how they feel like it? I think it's just kind of whenever they feel like changing they'll change um, so this would be nice to actually get uh, to terms with some weapons we haven't had for a while or haven't seen at all actually um, because there are some weapons we're still looking to find uh, only thing is we've got to keep a good look out on uh, what, what weapons we have to know when to reload um, we're also going to be looking for gun mods rather than actual weapons themselves so not that we can really kind of do anything about that uh, this gun is lasting a lot longer, and it's got a real, real, real bad clip size. Uh, but it's powerful, so we let it slip this time around. Uh, we've got some more enemies. Where are they at? This room always catches me out. They always end up in some really awkward places. There we go. No, we missed. So we've got the alternative pilot costume on. I've had them for absolute ages, and didn't realise that they were just sitting there waiting for me to use. So. Oh, look at that. Got some ammo. Effectively useless, but there is a secret. Got some money. Got a blank back. Got some armor. Um, that was a pretty good return, to be honest. Quite happy with the way that uh, panned out there. Uh, and a blue chest as well. We'll open that one. Uh, Anvil, and that's going to change our weapon to something else. Uh, what did we get? Old Goldie, is that one? I'm not sure. I don't think I've ever seen this one. Oh, that's definitely not a Goldie, is it? <laughs> I don't know what that is. But I like it. Alright, uh, you know what, uh, there's no reason to not fight them off straight away because our weapons are effectively what they are. Oh, is this not a charged shot, but it's awfully powerful. Fuck me, what is this? I've never seen this one before. Bad reload speed, but you know what, I don't even care. If it's going to do the... Whoa, 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 whoa. What was that shot? I've never fucking seen that one before. Ah, oh, we'd get the dowser. I mean, it'll do the job. It will take us halfway slowly as long as we keep our distance. We've got the uh, we've got the range capable of dealing this damage here. Just got to be real careful for that um, ballistic shot. Okay, now we're on to the laser rifle. It's quite crazy, but I quite like playing the gun game because, um, like I say, we get to test out a lot of new weapons, a lot of weapons we haven't seen in a while um, and generally makes this first floor a lot easier, especially with the commando nice alright uh, so that's the kiln pot uh, the, the kiln fire spots um, but what do we want to do, we want to come and finish off the floor before we do anything else just to make sure this is a pretty sweet gun as well I forgot that it fires the hand upon reload <laughs> Which we can actually, we should be able to direct ourselves as well. So we'll keep that in tow for a minute. Already found our secret uh, secret room. I always get those two bloody mixed up secret room and secret floor, and it's not even that hard, is it? We can actually control that. But we're just tearing shit up. Now we're onto the witch pistol. Um, I think we're almost there. And we also left the key behind in the um, boss room. I didn't even see that. How did we do that? Is it worth taking the time out to open up the fireplace, do you think? Is it worth doing that? And taking a risk with the lockpick? Well, probably not if we're going to find it once we've cleared all the rooms out, because we can only use one lockpick then. Um, chicken murder, just because we can. And more keys. So, a key is going to be helpful in this particular run. I think money is going to be more 
prolific for us. But then, actually, I tell you, if we come into play with one of the with the key beggar, not the key beggar, the uh, key seller, not the key seller, the key, oh, the guy, the lock. Uh, then maybe we can buy something from him rather than using the key to open chests. But we'll see. Uh, where's that switch? I want to shoot that switch. Okay, I completely missed. Nice easy room, nice bit of armour. So we're stacking up health fast and furious here, uh, which I'm a big fan of. Uh, you know what, let's go and open this chest anyway. Uh, we've got a spare key, we'll be back up to two. What weapon is this? Oh, this is the Rubidine Mark II, I think. Uh, which is pretty nice. Uh, so we'll... Exactly what I was about to say. We're going to be looking for uh, items that kind of uh, help our gunplay as opposed to guns. Because there's no point picking up guns because it's just going to switch out what we have already. So that's why we missed the key. Okay. Let's come up. We use our last blank in here just on the off chance there is a secret. No, there's not. Okay, down to the next floor. So pretty good start, I think. Pretty good start. I'm happy with that. So thanks to all those guns, we're in pretty good standing for the first floor. Uh, but can we keep it up? That's the question. So let's go straight in. This is the Zorgun, I believe. What was that a bullet ball shot? Did it just shoot out? Do they always shoot out bullet balls? Oh, now we've got the... I can't remember what this one is called. Gilded Hydra. Real powerful gun. Uh, but the reload speed is not the best. It is, I think it's better for fighting bosses than it is uh, just regular enemies. But even so, uh, any weapon that's going to do high damage, I'm glad to be having. I'm going to be one-shotting these guys. Okay, we switched guns and I didn't realise there, so... So be more careful, kind of keeping an eye on our guns. Get that guy out in one clip. Alright. Now we've got the mahogany. Just got to play real careful. Those guys try and guess where we're going to be. Uh, let's check out the shop early, just to see if there's anything worthy in there. What do we have? Um, Potion of Gun Friendship. Yeah, you know what? I think that's something we should probably buy. Can't afford it yet, but we will come back and buy that. I remember this gun uh, shooting faster, but I think that was probably something we had that made it do that. So good. We'll go back to the little guy in a minute. I was already halfway through. So here we go. And again, I'm going to apologise for that uh, rain in the background. It's really coming down heavy now. Uh, I need to find a way to block out that noise if possible. Uh, what have we got here? Whoa. Whoa. Have we had this before? My God. Okay. We missed there. Pretty bad shot. It looks like it just takes everything out. Everything in the room. Uh, now we're back to the old uh, sidearm. See, this is where the worry comes in. Um, when you're fighting a particular boss, or the dragon, or the lich, uh, you'll get a handgun. Well, it's possible that you'll get a handgun. Uh, and that can really make or break a run. Oh, you know what? I saw that bullet coming. But my uh, reaction speed didn't quite accommodate the time that I needed for that to... Uh, be avoided. Uh, let's go straight up. Got to remember to reload my guns before going through. Uh, you know what? We'll take a risk with the lockpick and then, yes, we'll use the key. Uh, because these ones usually don't. Table text done, that's going to be pretty handy. Uh, usually don't contain weapons, uh, from, from my own experience anyway. So if we do that, we can stun them and just one shot everything to death. Pretty happy about that. Another table here for the next spawn. Do that with spawn. Got the Mershot gun now. 
Uh, I want the bullets out as quickly as possible. Alright. Make our way down. Making our way down to... <laughs> I don't actually know the words to it. Uh, yeah, we might as well. Uh, gun is essentially worthless, but uh, we switched up for the elephant gun. Uh, oh, actually, I didn't even see that room down there. Let's make our way down. And so this is the crest room, which we didn't go to the Ubi yet, so there's nothing to do there. Nothing to see here, guys. We'll stun them, get those shots in. Oh. <laughs> Completely missed. And now we've got the uh, sidearm. All right. You know what? We should probably spam. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. We should probably spam this weapon here because. Uh, oh, okay. <laughs> Didn't matter. Uh, what's this? The mass shotgun now, uh, which I really like, especially for bosses. Let's go for the boss. But I'm not sure whether it's very good for just uh, room clearing. And actually, um, the rockets. It would be an issue with the rockets as well here. So we do have. Oh, we've got the disintegrator now. Anyway, let's keep a nice, <clears throat> clean stream on him. <clears throat> Use that blank there. Oh no. I should have used the second blank. This is where we have the issue in getting this gun to work here. It takes a while to kind of charge. And I've uh, got the hammer. Got good enough reload speed to not worry about the um, rockets. So, I don't know, I'm a bit disappointed with myself for that one, because we could have done a bit better there, we could have got some extra health. But, we didn't, so, nothing we can do about that. But I believe we've still got one chest to find, have we got one chest to find still? Uh, yes, yes, we've opened two chests, but only one chest room, so, uh, it looks like the next one will be around here somewhere. <clears throat> oh, just switched over to the Corsair mid-shot. Uh, I believe this gets more powerful the longer it's in the air for. But as far as clearing a room quickly, it's not very good. Oh, okay. <laughs> I've switched over to Shades Revolver. Which is pretty good. Can't say shit about it, especially with the uh, scope. Uh, it's just going to home in on pretty much everything. There's a blank. It's fantastic. And these are going to go out in more or less one hit. So I shouldn't really spam the shots. I should kind of take my time to just aim them. Um, make our way down. Looks like our chest, but we haven't got a key, but we do have. Oh, do we have enough money? No. <clears throat> it's only selling two things. I've never seen that before. I would have blank 66. Uh... You know, I don't think we've got anything to kind of uh, make it work, so uh, check out the shop. We was going to buy the Potion of Gun Friendship anyway, so we'll do that. How much is the key? Okay, you know what, that worked out pretty much more or less in our favour there. Um, check. Oh, I should have pressed that button, shouldn't I? God damn it, I can't go all the way around again. Well, it's not that far, so it's fine. Um, check for secret rooms, because we don't need the blanks anymore. If not, uh, we'll open this. Oh, okay, yeah, I'm pretty... I was about to say, let's shoot that. I'm pretty glad. Oh, and look at that as well. More armour, another chest with another key. So that's pretty nice. Um, got no means of stealing anything, so we'll just go through to the next lot. There's tons of health just laying around. We've got nothing to kind of um, get health drops, so that's all just kind of random. Which is surprising because you don't really see health that often just dropping like it's candy. Use a blank in here as well, just because we can.
So down to, what's this, the, uh, the mine? Level three, I think. Yes, black powder mine. So we should try and make a habit of using the potion just to make things happen a bit faster. Oh, just fucking tearing shit right up. Oh, didn't see you there, mate. I believe it charges fairly quickly. Watch out for these guys, son of a bitches. Son of a bitches, sons of bitches. Come on. Got that last shot in before he. No, where's he gone? Totally forgot we had table text done. So let's use that. Does the stun do any damage? I don't think it does. Oh, Herobrine. No, not Herobrine. Uh, heroine. Uh, and let's your trigger finger. Yes, pretty good. Rate your fire up. Nice. Charge on the way in. these bullets. Oh, <laughs> I thought we was going to get him. There we go. That's better. Much better. Uh, let's go down this way first. Not a fan of bow based weapons. Now we need to get that guy out of the way. As soon as. There we go. Oh, what have we got now? <laughs> this thing. Don't come this way. All right. Oh, almost got poisoned then. Uh, open up this. Uh, so the mimic friendship or no, the um, grand prism. So we'll get some health if we destroy chests, which you know what I'm going to hold on to. One, because we can and it doesn't take up any inventory space. Two, because late game, if we need some health, uh, rather than opening chests with guns, um, there's a way to gain health and not have to worry about health too much, which hopefully needs to be a thing. Uh, if we could find something that would uh, augment the way we take damage from the poison, fire, you know, well, the gas mask. That's kind of what I was going to be getting at. I was just going to around the bush and try and explain but no if we can get the gas mask or some kind of resistance against uh, any of the elements then I think we're pretty much set I would have liked to have had the extra health foot you know what no all right I was gonna say can we just munch guns infinitely but clearly not so yeah it's a shame that we lost out on the beholster um, Flawless. But again, uh, you know, we need to be doing a few of these kills when we get the chance for the trophy. Okay, now we're down to standard weapon. And now we're up to the wind-up gun. Which I'm really not a fan of. Anything that starts off strong gets weaker as your clip goes down. I mean, you don't want to be reloading every five minutes, do you? Well, not five minutes, five seconds rather. Key. Uh, it sounds like there's a gun game around. So we'll keep an eye out for that. No tables in here to help us out. You know what? Uh, I used my potion of gun friendship, but it was just a little bit too late. By the time that I started to switch out weapons, uh, I'd taken the damage already, so. And we're on fire now. God damn it. I don't know why that wasn't up on our first um, thing anyway. Uh, okay, so. Looks like a fairly easy one. Let's try it. 35. Oh. Oh. We can't afford it. <laughs> we have no money. Make our way down here. Oh, 
Oh, really? God damn it. So these guys we want out of the way. Uh, that'll put us down to 20 left to go, I think. If I'm keeping count correctly. We did check before and it was 22. We've only killed two of them so far, so. Uh, ammo, useless. Bullet bore. I wanted to get the big guy first. Get him now. Okay, lovely. So he's going to be taking damage. They're all going to be dying. Let's flip a table. Flip another table. Another one. Another one. I think that's probably enough. Alright. There's our shop. What do they have in store for us today? Uh, armor. How much is the armor? 30. So I don't think we'll buy any of that. We want to play the gun game. Well, do we want to play the gun game, actually? That's a good point. Is it worth playing the gun game? Because we don't want weapons. So, you know what? Maybe we will buy the armor instead. Oh, I've got the microtransaction gun. What the fuck is it shooting out? <laughs> Little characters of uh, the guys. It's the first time I had this. I quite like this. It's uh, good fun. Uh, let's go through with this gun. Is it any good? I don't know. But we'll use the friend gun friendship and just shoot as quick as possible. Of course we'd get that on this guy. But we managed to avoid his first onslaught this time around. But we could do with something <clears throat> a bit more proficient at killing this boss here. Like that. But by the time it's too late. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. Okay, so we've got that AU gun. If we can hit, that's okay, don't worry. It's already gone. So gun friendship helping us out here. And the guns are changing. Uh, yeah, the guns are changing over very quickly now. Oh, Fucking damage right at the end there. And then we're gonna have to deal with this shit again. Alright. I mean, we're gonna survive anyway, so what's the issue? What did we spend our money on? Why, why don't we have any money? Ah, oh, completely stumped. Did we buy. We didn't buy the armor, did we? What the hell happened to our money? I don't even know. Uh, we've got another ring. Uh, mimic friendship, unlikely allies. Uh, does that mean we don't get the mimics? I don't remember, let's have a quick check. Um, makes chest safer. Okay, not actually a ring, but rather a small creature pretending to be a ring. It makes a strange psychic tone, only recognizable to mimics, preventing them from attacking. Okay. Um, where did our money go? I mean, we've got 15 now, but during that fight we had zero, and before we went in there, I'm sure we had some, so... I don't know, unless... I've just completely forgotten that I'd spent some. Which could be a thing. Oh. There you go, Jaws. <laughs> I know, we want to be in there. Oh, it doesn't matter. Too late. <laughs> become shark bait. Oh, okay. Now we're back to the. Is that the Winchester shotgun? Or the sword off? I'm not sure. Doesn't matter though. Oh, we've got the flare gun again. So are we set. Are we. Do we get locked into a specific rotation of guns when we play uh, the Blessed Run or. Is it just random? Because we've had a couple of guns more than once. Maybe it's just down to their drop rate. The higher the drop rate, the more often uh, we're likely to see the guns. But then that could potentially change each run anyway, couldn't it? I don't know. I'm not going to try and pull the game apart now. Uh, that's the blooper. But, oh man, we've got the tentacle, but nothing to kill it with. Alright, let's buy some armour. Get the fuck out of here. 
Do I want to look for a secret room? No, not really. You know what, we'll use it anyway. <laughs> Even though there's nothing to kill. Use a blank. Nope. All right. Hopefully we can get some technical kills in. Yeah, at least one. All right, I'm pleased with that. And these ones will actually go through the walls as well, which is really handy. If you're having, to, but only once it locks onto an enemy. But um, if you're having an issue killing an enemy, you can just hide the fuck away and let this weapon do the job. But it's over. <clears throat> all over. But we're doing all right. I'm feeling confident so far that we're gonna make it at least to the dragon, or at least to the boss of this floor. Um, this fourth floor boss can sometimes catch me off guard. Oh, where did that come from? Don't want to be spawning another one of those. Oh, he got away with it. Jammy fucker. Alright. Flame hand, he's alright. Does damage over time rather than good contact damage. But rooms like this, we can just kind of set them on fire, hide for a bit, let them take their ticks of damage, and not have to worry too much. As long as we're not taking damage on the rooms, then it is all good. There we go. Now we don't have to reload this, so that's real handy as well. Is he still alive? He's still alive. Not for much longer. <laughs> Disintegrator. Not as powerful as I feel that this gun should be. Oh, oh then again, actually, to be honest, maybe it probably is, actually. Talking out my fucking ass. It's very powerful. Especially big guys like this that we don't want to be fighting. All right. Extra blanks is always going to be handy. Now, rather than look for secret rooms now, we're going to try and save the blanks for the late game. Try not to screw ourselves over. Now we can start everything. Lots of tables here. Keep them in place. Make things a bit easier on us. Uh, what's that? Origani. I'm not sure how I feel about this gun. Um, this is one of the first guns I ever picked up. But, um, I mean, it's alright. It does the damage. But then we do have the uh, trigger finger. Without that, I don't think the gun would be as powerful. But then it goes that way for every weapon, doesn't it, in the game? Uh, so let's take the bottom route first, just to get it out of the way. That's the furthest we've got to walk, so we might as well go down there straight away. Uh, I think that was ammo, wasn't it? Oh, I didn't even get a chance to read it. I think it was ammo that we left behind. All right, Shelton. You're not having any of us today. Oh, yes, you are. All right, okay. I spoke too soon. Oh, that guy, he just gets me. That's better. Come on, we've got to get him before he spawns back up. There we go, just about. Oh, dear. So we lost a good bit of health there. Uh, oh, my God, armor synthesizer. Play well. Get armor. That's exactly what we want. Now we just want the uh, health synthesizer. And then I don't think we'll have anything to worry about. We should have a statue here. What have we got? Um, blood sacrifice. You know what? If we get a flawless on this boss, I'll do it. If we don't, it can fuck off. Thanks to that. Oh. Too many of those. That's better. Oh. Oh, 
All right, so back up to full health at least. And what do we get in this room? All right, you know what? I'm gonna use the gun friendship. <laughs> oh my god, that rate of fire. Holy fuck. My god, gun friendship and the itchy trigger. Ruins it. Missed the charge there. It's all good though. There's some armor. We're not getting uh, oh, my ammo. There's some ammo, but we're not getting much armor, was what I was trying to say. Alright. Another room up here. We haven't found the boss yet, have we? Whoops. Totally shot the table then. Alright, this is going real smooth. Now we've got a chest here which uh, I use a lockpick. No, that's a shame. There is some health there though, if we need it. Check the secrets. And how are we doing? So there's one room over there. I've got a feeling. Um, mm, no, don't worry. <laughs> Let's tangle them up. Oh, I've got this goddamn bow. I feel as if we've got a good amount of damage going on here now. Still getting tons of health. But I shouldn't complain. Whoops, sorry shopkeep. I think it slipped. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna buy a blank. Just to be safe. Ah oh, man, that's exactly what I was saying. Um, can't afford any of it. Um, the ballot could be good. That gives us extra drops, I believe. Uh, we've got some keys out, but we can't afford them now because we kind of uh, went a bit gung-ho there. Um, let's come down and we'll just see what happens here. Uh, thanks to the ammo, punk. Fuck you, rat. I don't want to go into battle with this bow, so I'm hoping it's going to change before we get there. Okay, and I don't want to go into battle with a helix either because I'm not a fan. Polaris, on the other hand, I'd be very happy. It'll probably change before we um, go down to the boss anyway. Alright. So let's go straight in. Now we're going to use blanks if we need to. Oh god, it's this guy. Fuck this guy. Oh man managed to get hit in so we've lost a flawless already but this guy I just I'm hopeless against this guy I just can't do it give me the kill pillars give me the warmonger it's all good but this guy I just can't fathom the fight I didn't want to have to use that blank It's the fact that there's those constant bullets just floating around, always, which have now disappeared. Oh, oh man. What weapon is this? Don't believe I've seen this one before. And it's not really helping us out very much, is it? Wow, actually it's slowing him down. <clears throat> now we got the witch pistol. Try and get these heads out of the way real quick. But it acts as a good defense mechanism for him because it just pushes us away from him. Then we've got to find our way back over. All right, another round of these god awful bullets. And we get that ant. 
or the Gungeon Ant. This is taking way too long, taking too much damage. God, are we gonna die? We can't die, come on. Alright, oh, well, the skin of our teeth. Well, actually, we had a bit more health than. Uh... <laughs> Where did the little teddy bears come from? <laughs> Bug boots, nice. We've got some armour. You know what? I think we're gonna be able to fill our health all the way up anyway, so uh, I'm not too worried about that. We'll just go collect some health. Um, oh, we still can't afford the keys. That's a real shame. Or blanks either. Let's go around. Let's pick up health. Maybe look for a secret room instead then. That's where we're going to get the most use out of what we've got here. Bug boots will come in fairly handy I think. I think we already checked this here, so. Uh, was that it for health? I thought we had a bit more. Clearly not. No, I'm not worried about ammo. We can get that back upon switching weapon. Just kind of do a few shots around. Uh, where is it likely to be, though? I mean, you know what? We'll do the usual. We'll um, we'll use it in the elevator room on the way out. Otherwise, we're gonna just spend forever looking for that. Let's come up. Use it in here. Ah, look at that! Fantastic. So we've got some armor there. So we're down on just one health, which is okay. Um, to be honest, you know what? I feel that making that blood sacrifice will help us a bit later as far as damage goes. So you know what? We're going to do it. Gives us a bit of curse, but you know what? I think that's the first bit of curse we've got all run. So um, if I'm not mis mistaken, I don't think that really does much. It only gives us, say... 10% chance for the jammed enemies to spawn. I could be wrong there, but I think it's a 10%. I always keep meaning to turn my beast mode off as well. Not that it makes any difference, but it's there. <laughs> so where are we now? We, we, that was a hollow. So we'll be uh, going up against the dragon now. Uh, and all things going well, we'll kill the dragon and we'll go down to bullet hell. If we're going to be one shot on these guys, that's pretty awesome. Oh, not anymore though. But the Brick Breaker, definitely one for the books. Just remember to be flipping these tables and we're all good. Ah, oh, really? Okay, so key, <laughs> ammo. Not going to do much for us, but. Oh man. Oh no, you're kidding me. Could be fucking joking. No tables in here. Just use a gun friendship potion and just wreck them. Oh no, we changed to something else. That's the trouble, when we get a charge weapon, if we're tapping our button, we will get caught out. Oh, this one takes a bit longer to charge than normal weapons as well, so we've got to be careful here. Oh, and it's changed. Oh man, you know what, we're fucking throwing now. Really throwing. And this is what I mean about um, being given a really terrible weapon when you need it the least. Did we get him? Okay, we got him. 
Now we're going to deal with a few more guys. I don't think this weapon is going to help us out very much. So we just hemorrhaged tons of health. Alright, got the cactus. Something good in here. Uh, we'll do it for a gun. Mm. Oh, but we did get that. Um, you know, I got a feeling that I'm going to leave the armor there. I don't think the rat takes it, does he? Will he take it? No. It's like the health and the keys. The rat won't take those. Um, Purely based on the fact that it's like if we get down to half a heart, uh, we can go pick that up and um, give us a bit of extra life. That's provided we actually survive a room that we're having issues on. But I think um, two and a half hearts is enough to do some of these rooms here. T shirt, oh fuck. T shirt cannon, okay. Good knockback, it keeps them away from us anyway. We could do with some more mods to our guns here. Uh, ammo. I think that's probably the safest move we could have made. Oh no. Took some stupid damage there. Unicorn gun. Can we listen to the entire song? Oh no, because I set myself on fire. What a fucking idiot. You can go into the drink. Really? You're going to respawn me like that? rude. It's not very effective. <laughs> Alright, we're not able to get close enough to actually do some damage here. Oh, shit. We need to flip a table. Keep flipping tables. Oh, come on, what is this? What is this? Get fucked. Alright, so we've got a chest up here. <laughs> Let's go open this chest. Uh, and then we'll uh, go collect the health. So we've got the charm on. You know what? We'll take it in place of the lockpick. Uh, we'll go collect the armour. Oh, man. Hopefully we can do something about this issue we're having. Live to fight another room. All right, proton backpack. Uh, we can deal with that one. That's pretty good. Another key. Not super helpful here. Glad that was a good table flip. Worked out quite nicely for us. Um, got a feeling our boss is going to be up here, and the shop is going to be down right at the bottom there. My cold gun's going to be fairly helpful. Here. Just suck everything in. And stick behind cover. Oh, but he's gone. And we've got the trident. Alright. So I was wrong, it was the other way around. I don't know why we're not selling well I guess I guess maybe they're not able to sell guns. 
so 41, 41. So two or four hearts, uh, I think, is what we're going to be buying, definitely. Let's collect the bullet. Let's buy those now to avoid going down here looking for the boss and then getting slaughtered. Uh, but we could do some blanks. So our biggest issue is blanks. Okay, we can just about manage that. Get that shot over there, just get the last shot to kill him. Nice. Room here. Uh, oh, there was a table there the whole time. God damn it. Uh, yep, yeah, let's do it. Uh, useless. Oh, I like that gun. Bundle of ones. Gonna be pretty nice here. Now, I'm getting this right. We did have. Armour synthesizer, not ammo, didn't we? Play well, get armour. And we're getting tons of ammo, but just no armour. We don't need the ammo. Ammo can suck my dick. More ammo. Oh, we bugged. Right, here we go. So, we had to clear out the entire fucking floor for that. No blanks. Mm. I think this could be over before we get even much of a chance here. We'll do our best, that's all we can do. Let's get stuck right in. around in this corner. Safest place for us. Oh no. Are we going to make it? It's not looking very good, is it? That's fucking it. Ah, oh, what a shame. What a shame. You know, I thought we were going to have it for a second there, but uh, it didn't quite work out. But uh, not a bad run, so... Um, I can say I'm fairly pleased with that, for, for, for a gun run anyway. So, uh, let's go back down to the breach.